Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to episode 23 of Headhunter. Hopefully the fight, the final episode. I hope to end game here. Slight problem is I have absolutely no health. Because I was absolutely decimated during the last two scenes. If I run quickly to this guy... Snap him and move on without even fighting the other guy. And hopefully that. Although I we did after the cutscene we saw last episode, we definitely have another fight to go. So I hope I get a med kit somewhere. Would be good game. Would be good. It's giving me everything but med kit. Make it in there, man. And I, I guess I'll just keep on using this as long as I can. And yeah, they're gonna give me stuff. No, this isn't actually going up. <laughs> I just checked that there. <laughs> right, so where do I go? What's my objective? Just go to the amphitheater. Okay, I can do that. I can go to the amphitheater. I... Do I have an adrenaline? Because if I don't, I don't know how the frick I'm gonna get through the boss fight at the end of the game. Angela? That's got it. Great. Let's go. Facility self-destruct This way! All personnel evacuate immediately. gonna die a lot. Well, I guess we use this. Dead. <laughs> of course. Thankfully, we come do this every time. Oh, it takes way too long to reload this. I can get to trigger that. Oh no, he's not gonna do it. Oh no, why did you do that? Oh, 
Oh, do I have adrenaline? Useless. I destroyed my own cover. Oh, that isn't even cover. And I'm out of everything. Oh, it sucks. Oh, his armor's down right before I'm about to die. Great. Let's try that again. Angela? Oh, come on. That was... Ah. I'm kind of doing a bit better than what I was doing before. Where's my adrenaline? I don't know how I avoid that. The way the targeting system automatically just looks right in front of you, you know, regardless of where the enemy actually is. Let's try this again again. Put on the first. Got, have I got... Oh, I didn't realise I had ones back here as well. well that's a game changer. Camera does not want to focus sometimes. Do I have any more over here? Oh, I do. Well, that's 
this gun is so bad. Man. We might as well be using the stimulator at this point. It's over there, Jack. That's my last cover. I understand what I'm supposed to do. That's great. I'm a bit. I always get him to that bit where he's. Serious business now. Angelo? Hide here. Get the rocket launcher out. Let him blow that up. Move over here so you're ready for cover. Oh. <laughs> Wish that actually gave you cover from that. Cover, how did that hit me? Look all those missiles. Oh. So little damage. Neither's that. Nothing is accurate in this game apart from the best of it. Slightly away from it. Did that hit me? Die. I just can't maintain health. Is his armor tied to blue pillars? Angela? Let's test this. Let's see if his armor is tied to the blue pillars. pillars.
because I think it may be because I'm pretty sure I saw the pillar explode when his armor went away. With all these back ones, oh come on, I'm stuck. With all these back ones first. Touch the missile launcher yet. I'll touch the missile launcher and not touch any adrenal. This will be test, see. This color goes, and his armor goes. Oh, it didn't. Don't I feel dumb? Try and save the adrenaline for when I need it. I'm gonna try and save the vessel launcher for when his armor's down. should be missile launch of time. Still does that red attack, but I still have a train on it. Where did he drop the gun? That's what I need to know. Where did he drop the gun? Because I'm gonna need to use it. No idea where he dropped this. Oh. Where 
did he drop it? Before I blast them with anything, oh, I think I see it. Do I see it? It's, no, I don't. Ah, here it is. This corner right over here, right? So let's get him far away. Make a run for it. Oh, we did it. We done it. Enjoy the end of the game. Oh yeah, you're not coming back from that boil. Starting final countdown. Self-destruct imminent. Swyberg's dream. There's still millions of people with the virus inside them. Without Swyberg's broadcast to trigger it, it's harmless. Angela, about your father. It's over. The men responsible are dead. I feel like my whole life just got wiped away. I know the feeling. It's time to start over. Just you and me and the stimulator automatic. I'm Kate Gloss with All You Need to Know. Today's top story, Headhunters Call the Shots. Following the shock resignation of ACN Chief Alan Sharp and an accidental blaze at biotech research labs, it seemed like criminals would have a field day. With ACN officers working traffic duty and biotech unable to monitor criminal control chips, felons went on a spree which saw values on the criminal exchange soar to record levels. However, latest figures suggest Governor Hernandez is turning the tide, the headhunters responding enthusiastically to his Make My Day initiative, which promises less regulation and substantial bonuses for every felon captured. With arrests at a six-month high and the Aquadome forced to cap prisoner numbers with a weekly con bad cull, it seems the headhunters really are making a killing. In other news, voices from the deep. Salvage team seeking to recover organs from the wreck of Don Fulci's ship, the Queen of Hearts, today confirmed that unexplained signals are emanating from the seabed. This follows reports of interference to satellite navigation equipment from shipping in the area. Experts say this is not a standard distress signal, but until divers clear debris from the ship's transmitter, it's impossible to say what the...
there we go. That's a headhunter. Produced by Sega, developed by Amuse. I believe it was developed by Amuse. What a great game. I love that. It was very fun. Combat was uh, frustrating at times. Some mechanics were frustrating. We had stealth mix, snap mechanic. Uh, requiring you to be a precise spot for the trigger. Uh, the quick menu navigation was a little bit off for me. Um, I get shot up way too much. Uh, and I'd prefer just to use the pause menu to equip things. But overall, the game was solid. Like, yeah, created and developed the base. John Crockney and Philip Lawrence are responsible, written by Philip Lawrence, so Philip Lawrence is really the guy responsible for that bizarre twist at the ending. Um, but it was, it was a fantastic game, a really great time. This was great back in the day as well. Um, so back in the day this was probably brilliant. Obviously compared to nowadays standards it's different, but we don't compare it to nowadays standards, it's an unfair comparison. But um, I still had fun with this game, even in 2022. So yeah, great game. There is a sequel, Headhunter Redemption, I might do at some point, but... But yeah. Thanks for being here. Hope you've enjoyed. Enjoy the credits.